Ladies and gentlemen, good morning from Paris and welcome to our preview of TFWA World Exhibition and Conference uh, taking place in Cannes in a few short weeks time. Uh, my name is John Rimmer, I'm the Managing Director of TFWA and it's my pleasure to welcome you to this short preview that is designed just to give you a flavour of what's in store in Cannes uh, early next month and to help you make the most of the event with the various tools that we have available. I can see that many of you are joining us from different parts of the world and it's a pleasure uh, to see you all here and it's going to be wonderful uh, to see you in Cannes in a few weeks time. So welcome and uh, if you have any questions or have any comments that you'd like to make, uh, please don't hesitate to use the uh, chat box uh, that you can see on the uh, audience page. So without further ado, let's get uh, let's get started. And as I say, give you a flavour of what's in store. Uh, I hope the dates are already in your diary, 2nd to the 6th of October, uh, a nice early autumn uh, slot uh, for us on the Côte d'Azur. Uh, we're looking forward very much to seeing you there. So. What can we expect in Cannes in 2022? Well, um, as you know, uh, we at TFWA like to get everything organized in advance. And so we've ensured that the weather is going to be joining us uh, at the uh, Côte d'Azur. We can guarantee you lots of lovely sunshine. Uh, and if we don't get any sunshine, uh, you know who not to blame. Uh, but seriously, we are looking forward to, uh, to uh, what we hope will be another very, very busy week. Uh, we have very busy halls. Uh, to uh, welcome you. Uh, we have over 20,500 square metres of exhibition space uh, booked. That's uh, a significant increase on, on last year, of course. Uh, and also a very encouraging number of pre-registered delegates, visitors, buyers, landlords and agents uh, coming to uh, visit Cannes from around the world. And we'll uh, have a look at the, uh, the directories in a short, uh, in a short while. Uh, the the uh, map of the, the Palais uh, is available online uh, for you to get your bearings. I think many of you are uh, veterans of this event and I'm sure that you uh, know your way around the Palais. Uh, but as always, we will have uh, various villages uh, available with lots of amazing stands to visit. Um, you'll, if, again, if you uh, don't know your way around, you'll be able to check out the maps which will be available both on site and on the TFWA app. And there's also a, a wayfinding function, which we'll touch on a little bit later. World-class brands, that's what CAN is all about. And I'm delighted that we're going to be welcoming hundreds of brands uh, to the event this year. Some amazing new launches, amazing stands, amazing products. And if you want to get a feel for the exhibitors that, uh, that we have with us in CAN this year, um, I would encourage you to take a look at the exhibitor list, uh, which is available on tfwa.com. Uh, if you go into the, the CAN pages, uh, you can visit that and search it by product category. So here, for example, we have all our friends in the perfume and cosmetics uh, sector that will be joining us. Uh, you can also search by location if you want to see everybody who's in the Blue Village, for example, the Yellow Village, the Riviera Village. Uh, you can also search uh, by uh, location. So um, TFW members, of course, have their contact details listed as part of that, um, as part of that service on the exhibitor list. Uh, but this is a good place to start to plan your event and to take a look at the different brands that will be with us this year. So check out the exhibitor list. Private meetings, uh, it's all about business obviously can, it's hopefully about fun too, but uh, business is our principal reason for being there. There'll be ample opportunity to hold meetings on your stand and elsewhere uh, during the week. Um, there are lots of business opportunities. That's what uh, this event is all about. Uh, and we have some tools available to try and help you make the most of your time in Cannes. And we're going to take a look at a couple of those now uh, via our TFWA 365 online platform. Now, I hope some of you are uh, familiar with, uh, with this platform. Uh, it's where we uh, locate some of the key tools uh, that we hope you'll uh, use uh, during your time uh, with us in CAM. Let's take a look first at the uh, networking section. Uh, networking is obviously a key pillar of the 365 platform and the directories uh, are hopefully uh, one of the tools that you'll be using in the, in the run up to the event. So uh, we have uh, three directories linked to the event this year. We have the exhibitor di delegate directory, the visitor delegate directory and the iLab uh, directory. More about the iLab in a few minutes, but let's first take a look at the visitor delegate directory. Here you have all of the pre-registered 
buyers, landlords, operators and agents and other trade visitors um, that are uh, already pre-registered for the event. You can see we have over 3,300 people in this, in this uh, directory. Um, this is being updated in real time. So as we get more uh, registrations coming in and we're getting more every day, uh, those will be uh, included in this directory. So uh, the directory is searchable by product category. It's also searchable by company name and country. Let's maybe start with uh, taking a look at a company name, maybe if we put do free uh, into the search engine, we can see all of the friends uh, registered from do free and there they are. Uh, you'll recognize a lot of those faces, I'm sure. Uh, if you want to uh, search also by country, you can see um, locate the, the, the colleagues from do free who are from a specific country or, or region. Um, let's say Hong Kong, for example, there we go. If we uh, check out who is available or who is coming to the show from do free. Uh, Hong Kong, and we can find, there we go, four uh, friends who will be welcoming you can. And of course, you can send messages uh, via the directory and request a contact. So there we have our friend Pedro Castro. I'm looking forward to seeing Pedro in Cannes this year. And if you want to drop Pedro a line, uh, you can message him uh, and request a meeting. And that message will go directly into the inbox of your contact, and they can reply to you directly uh, using your email. So it's a, a way to request a meeting, request a contact, uh, and we hope that you'll make the most of that uh, in, the, uh, in the directory function. So there we go. Um, as I say, you can search by country. So this is quite what we hope will be uh, a useful function uh, for you. Um, if you say, for example, Let's take a look at Korea. If you can de-click Hong Kong, that's right, and then click on Korea. Let's see which industry friends will be welcoming from there. So there you go. In the directory now, you have all of the different pre-registered delegates uh, who are coming in from South Korea. Uh, again, you can uh, search by uh, product category, uh, and you can also send messages uh, and request a meeting uh, with the different people uh, that you see there. So uh, we hope that that uh, directory will be useful. Uh, it's um, something that uh, we'll be developing as we go. We're perfect and trying to perfect it uh, year on year and, uh, and bring improvements, uh, but we'll be delighted if you can try and make the most of that, uh, of that function and let us know how it works and, and how you'd like to, uh, to improve, how you'd like us to improve it. Let's take a look at the exhibitor delegate directory as well. So here, We've included the main contacts and the stand contacts uh, for each uh, exhibitor. Uh, so you can, uh, if you want to request a, a meeting uh, with any of those companies, uh, you can do so in the same way. You can search by product category. Let's have a look at wines and spirits, for example. So that will now filter through all of the different exhibitors in wines and spirits. And you can drop them a line uh, to suggest meeting up in Cannes. There we have Philippe from Albert Bichot who will be delighted to, to welcome to Cannes once again. Uh, and you have all the other companies listed there. So uh, we hope that the directories will be useful for you. Again, uh, please let us know uh, if you have any ways that we can improve it. Uh, again, it's, it's a relatively new tool that we're working on year on year uh, to hopefully make it uh, more useful for you as we go. Before we leave um, TFW 365, uh, just to look at a couple of other uh, functions of the platform. Uh, it's also um, where we have the possibility of uh, including brand pages uh, for TFWA members, and that's in the discovery section of uh, the platform. In brands, you'll see all these different TFWA members have used the platform to uh, highlight their new product launches, uh, the range of uh, products that they have, the different brands, and, uh, and also to include new things on their social media, video content, etc. So uh, here we have Forio, for example, who will be delighted to, to see in Cannes again this year, we have some video content, we have a uh, possibility of contacting the company. So the key people from Forio are listed here and you can email them. Also, you have, if you're a buyer that wants a, a meeting with Forio, you can leave your business card uh, in, the, uh, in the, uh, the box here. Uh, there we go. So it's uh, hopefully something that TFWA members are going to make use of and a way just to get a bit of extra visibility and to tell people about the different launches that you have in CAM. And again, on 365, just to just to uh, another little uh, another little function, if you go back on the home page, uh, you have a meet the press uh, button there. There we go. Uh, Travel Retail Trade Press, obviously a key partners for us and uh, very important in terms of 
uh, visibility uh, for your, your uh, new launches uh, and for everything that's going on in CAM. Um, they will be present and you can, you can read the, the different magazines uh, using the Meet the Press section in 365. So we encourage you to, to check that out. And we look forward to, to meeting the various uh, journalists at the, at the show in a few weeks' time. And just to complete the tour, the uh, learning part of the um, uh, of the platform that's where you currently are if you're uh, if you're watching this uh, this preview um, live conferences is the, the obviously the live webinars but the, all of our uh, different conferences will be available to review in replays uh, so that's where you can go for uh, replays of the tfwa uh, world conference and workshops in cam and also medfa and the other conferences that we uh, that we're uh, proud to organize so uh, replays is where you'll uh, you'll go for uh, the various um, reviews of our conference sessions. Okay, um, one more um, key fun uh, service that we'd like to mention with regard to uh, meetings in CAM is the TFWA one-to-one -one meeting service. Uh, this is uh, for those of you who uh, have not yet filled your diaries and uh, there are other meetings that you'd like us to help arrange. Uh, you can get in touch with us uh, via the one-to-one -one, uh, at tfwa.com uh, email address. We have a dedicated team uh, that can help brands link up with uh, companies, decision makers and stakeholders in travel retail who are registered for the one-to-one -one scheme. Uh, if you'd like to make the most of this service, if you're an exhibitor in CAM and would like to use this, uh, please don't hesitate to drop a line to one to one at tfwa.com and we'll do our very, very best uh, to link you up with the companies that you'd like to meet at the event. So if you want to use one to one, please get in touch. Okay, we have also a, a very full lineup of conference and workshops uh, at CAM this year. We're delighted that uh, the Monday morning workshop, uh, sorry, Monday morning conference, the Tiago Way World Conference, uh, will be uh, bringing together some very interesting speakers that we'll see in a moment. Uh, and we're also um, back with a program of workshops this year. Uh, these are happening on Tuesday and Wednesday, uh, a lunchtime slot, as we'll see. And they're in the very new uh, venue of the Hi5 studio that you can see here. Uh, this is a purpose built studio that the Palais de Festival uh, built uh, during the, uh, the, the lockdown period. Uh, this is on level five of the Palais de Festival and it's there that we'll be holding our two workshops this year. Uh, if you want to find out more about the conference and workshops, uh, we encourage you to look at the program online at tfwa.com. There you can see uh, the conference Monday morning, nine o'clock. Uh, this is the, the page where you can learn more about what's in store at that event. Delighted that our president, Eric Yule Mortensen, uh, will be giving his State of the Industry Address followed by three very interesting speakers, David McWilliams, a uh, very eminent and uh, entertaining uh, economist who will be joining us uh, to discuss uh, what's happening in the global economy, what's happening geopolitically, and how all this is going to impact on travel retail. We'll also be hearing from Raymond Klusterman, the founder of Rituals Cosmetics, a uh, very interesting uh, and articulate and charismatic entrepreneur. And we're delighted to welcome Swan Sit, who is a global authority on living in the metaverse, uh, which is one of the subjects, of course, that is uh, generating a lot of interest at the moment uh, in our industry and beyond. And we have a new moderator this year. I'm delighted that we're going to welcome Juliet Mann, who is a broadcaster and journalist uh, based in the UK. Juliet will be moderating our conference on Monday morning and uh, delighted to welcome her and uh, to see a fresh face on stage at the Grand Auditorium this, this year. As I mentioned, there are some workshops also Tuesday and Wednesday, uh, Tuesday lunchtime, 12.30 in the Hi5 studio, level five of the Palais de Festival. Um, Tuesday is going to be the airport forum workshop. Uh, this is designed to look at the future of non-aeronautical revenues in airports post-pandemic. And I'm delighted that we have senior executives from three major airports uh, joining us for this session. Uh, Fraser Brown from Heathrow, Ersin uh, Inokul from Istanbul Airport, and Sunbin in from Incheon, uh, all three uh, huge locations for duty-free and commercial revenues. And, uh, and we're delighted that they're joining us for that session. And I'll have the pleasure of moderating. So join us Tuesday lunchtime for that. For both of our workshops, we invite you to register uh, via the email at conference at tfwa.com. Uh, and you can do that via the website. I'll repeat that, uh, that uh, email a little bit later. On Wednesday, uh, Wednesday lunchtime, 12.30, same, same time, same place, 
Uh, we have the Innovation in Action Workshop. This will be moderated by my colleague, Michelle Miranda. Um, Michelle will be uh, joined by a number of speakers uh, who will be with us at the Innovation Lab, the iLab uh, this year, and I'll talk a, a little bit about that later. Um, you see a couple of speakers there who are, who are bringing new, fresh initiatives to travel retail and changing the way that brands and retailers engage with travellers. And we'll have a couple more speakers also to announce in the coming days and weeks. So uh, join Michelle and the team on Wednesday afternoon for Innovation in Action. Can of, of course is all about networking and you are gonna have many, many opportunities to meet your industry colleagues, friends and business partners over the course of the week. Uh, for many of you, it will be perhaps some years uh, since you've seen some people that you traditionally see every year in Cannes and we're determined to give you the opportunities you need to make the most of the week in terms of networking and we're delighted that we'll be able to welcome you from Sunday evening at the opening gathering get together on the Carlton Beach uh, that begins at 7 p.m all pre-registered delegates are welcome uh, to the Sunday gathering and also to our, um, uh, our networking opportunities during the week at the TFWA Lounge. Uh, those of you who had uh, who came to our event last year uh, will remember the after-work sessions that we held on the Carlton Beach at the TFWA Lounge. It was a really good, nice, informal vibe and we'll be continuing that this year. Uh, with after work sessions from 6.30 to 9 o'clock. Then there'll be a short break to let you maybe grab a bite to eat, go and see your other, other friends and contacts, and then join us again at the night session uh, from uh, 11 o'clock to late. So uh, this is all part of the program that you can find online, the get together at the TFWA lounge uh, as well. Uh, and also a word for our sponsors uh, who are um, very kindly supporting uh, our TFW Grey Lounge uh, events this, uh, this uh, year. Uh, you can see the companies listed there. And just a special mention of our main part partner, Qatar Duty Free. Uh, delighted to have Qatar supporting us again this year. And please don't, um, uh, don't miss out on uh, the special uh, competition that Qatar are organising at the TFW Grey Lounge uh, that can um, enable one lucky winner uh, to get tickets and flights uh, to the opening game in the FIFA World Cup. Uh, later this year in Qatar. So make sure you come to the TF and Ray Lounge for that. The winner will be announced by Tad Mosley uh, from Qatar Duty Free on Wednesday evening. The iLab, uh, delighted that the iLab is returning uh, in physical format uh, this year to uh, Cannes. Uh, the iLab will be uh, in a new venue this year in the Red Village. Uh, the basement level uh, within the Palais de Festival. Uh, we have a number of uh, very interesting exhibitors confirmed uh, for the iLab this year. Uh, you can check them out uh, in the list on the tfwa.com website. You can see some of the names there. Um, this is a, a service or a part of the event that uh, we're very passionate about. We want uh, CAN uh, to be about business, to be about existing uh, relationships, but we also want it to be about how uh, we market to the consumer in the post-pandemic world. How can we bring new things? How can we sell more effectively and differently uh, to a very demanding customer base? And these are companies that are giving brands and retailers new opportunities to market to customers. And, and we think it's a really important and exciting part of our event. So uh, check out the companies that you can visit in Cannes and be sure uh, to visit the iLab. Uh, you, can, you can check them out online in the first instance and then be sure to visit the Red Village uh, where you'll be able to see and meet the, uh, the uh, the companies that are bringing new things, new initiatives, new freshness uh, to travel retail. So be sure to visit the ILA um, uh, during your week in camp. So there's a recap of uh, just some of the key points in the program um, uh, this year. As I say, Sunday evening is where it all begins, and that's the get together uh, from 7 p.m. on the Carlton Beach. Do join us for that. I think it's going to be a really good enjoyable and and, uh, and friendly vibe and, and as i say the chance to catch up with some friends that maybe you haven't seen for a little while then of course join us on monday morning in the grand auditorium uh, for the tfwa world conference from 9 a.m we'll be starting 9 a.m sharp so make sure uh, that you're out of bed and on time for the conference uh, the exhibition on monday opens at 12 a.m immediately at, sorry 12 p.m uh, immediately after uh, the conference. Uh, we have uh, extended opening hours for uh, the exhibition this year and uh, with on Tuesday through to th uh, Thursday we'll be opening at 9 a.m and closing at 8 at 6 30 p.m on each day Monday through to Thursday. Uh, 
Uh, another mention for the workshops, please do join us for Airport Forum on Tuesday and Innovation in Action uh, on Wednesday. That's in the Hi-Fi Studio, Level 5 of the Pelle de Festival uh, from about 12.30 to 2 o'clock. Uh, replays will be available online after the event. TFWI Lab, join us for that. Some really interesting new solutions and fresh ideas uh, that you'll be able to see in the Red Village. One-to-one -one meetings, if you want to make the most of that service, as I say, uh, please email one-to-one -one at uh, tfwa.com. And of course, uh, social events during the week, one of the most important and enjoyable aspects of Can Week. Uh, join us at the TFWA Lounge from 6.30 for the afterwork sessions and from 11 uh, p.m. Uh, for the night session for those of you who want to uh, take your networking along into the early hours. Please do join us and a big thank you again to our sponsors who are, are making that happen. Tools and services, um, as I mentioned, um, we have a number of uh, services that we hope will help you make the most of Can Week, both before, during and after uh, the event. Our website, please do check out the website where you can get the basic information. Um, I should mention also um, one key uh, part of the event, which is uh, which is the, the, the health uh, regime that is in place. Hopefully, uh, many of you are aware that um, uh, the French authorities no longer have any restrictions on entry into France. You do not need to show a vaccine pass. You do not need a test uh, or anything like that to come into France, which is obviously great news. As a result, uh, you won't need to show any kind of vaccine pass uh, to get into the Palais, uh, as was the case last year. Uh, we are going to be making uh, disinfectants available, hand sanitizer and this kind of thing. We also encourage people to, uh, to, uh, in, uh, to respect social distancing wherever that's possible. Um, but the key thing is that there are no uh, overriding restrictions uh, that, that, that uh, we've had to deal with in the past. Um, some people uh, returning to Cannes may need a PCR test, depending on what the rules are in your country of origin. Uh, if that's the case, and uh, there is the possibility of reserving uh, a PCR test before you leave, and the details are available uh, on our website in, uh, in the pages dedicated to a World Exhibition and Conference. So check out our website for any practical information that you need. Uh, I mentioned CFWA 365. This is a uh, very uh, important uh, part of our overall service that, that, that we're aiming to provide to our delegates and, and exhibitors. And so check out the directories. We've had a quick look at those and how they work. So please make the most of those. Check out the brand pages online. Take a look at what TFWA members are going to be presenting in CAN this year. We also encourage you to download the TFWA app. Uh, that will be very useful uh, when you're on site because it will uh, contain the exhibitor list, it will contain the maps that help you to get around CAN, and it will also have a geolocalization function uh, which will enable you to get from A to Z uh, while you're on site, uh, hopefully with a minimum of fuss. And there you can see how the app looks and works uh, when you're with us in CAN. Also check out our social media, that's where we uh, share obviously updates and various news uh, that uh, Cecile and the team will be uh, will be releasing. So keep an eye on that. If you're not following us on uh, the various social networks, please do. Uh, press coverage, as I mentioned, uh, always crucial in CAN. Uh, we're grateful to uh, uh, friends and partners in the trade press for all that they do uh, in covering the event. So thanks, guys, and we look forward to seeing you in CAN. We also have our own uh, daily magazine, of course, uh, which will be distributed uh, on site, uh, which returns in a physical format this year. All of uh, what's going on in CAN, all the photos, all of the new launches, and some interesting interviews uh, with different industry stakeholders. So uh, be sure to uh, pick up a, a copy of the daily when you're in CAN. And of course, we have also the post event review, uh, which will be online at tfwa.com uh, in the week or so following uh, CAN. And you can check out some of the highlights of what we're sure will be a very busy, enjoyable, and memorable week. So yeah, there you go. That's a that's a quick run through of the uh, of the tools and services that uh, that are um, uh, available to you. I've seen we've had a few comments uh, coming in on the audience page. Uh, Eva from David off hi Eva, um, mentioning uh, the uh, uh, do are any tickets needed for the um, social events. Cecile, my colleague, has, has answered. So thanks, Cecile. Uh, just to reiterate that all uh, of the social events are open to badge holders, uh, free of charge. So if you've got a badge. Uh, feel free to join us at both the opening gathering in Cannes on Sunday and also at our after work sessions uh, and night sessions on the Carlton Beach during the, uh, during the week. 
Uh, Kamal Rotani asks if the interactive map uh, for Easy Access is ready. Uh, this will be ready on the TFWA app in good time for the event. So you'll be able to, once you're on site, uh, access uh, the map and, uh, as I say, uh, use a, a beacon uh, solution for uh, getting from A to Z. So uh, be sure to download the app and that's a tool that will be ready once we're on site. If anybody has any other questions or comments uh, that you'd like to make, uh, please uh, feel free to uh, put them into our chat box. Um, this session, in case any of your colleagues or uh, industry friends have not been able to join, uh, will be available in the replay section of our website. And if anybody would like to, uh, to have a, 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 another version of that to, to view uh, your leisure, uh, just let us know. Um, really, it's about sort of setting the scene, giving you a flavour of uh, what's in store in CAN and also encouraging you to use uh, some, of the, um, some of the tools that we have available. Uh, the team and I are at your disposal for any uh, extra information or assistance that you may require um, as, you, as we head into the event. Um, and I just want to say also that uh, the team, the board, the management committee, all of us at TFWA are really grateful for the support. Uh, that we've received from across the world uh, for the event this year. Uh, it's shaping up to be a really, really good event. We won't quite be on the same level as pre-COVID in terms of size, but we're getting there. And the atmosphere, I'm sure, is going to be really positive. Uh, and it's going to be an opportunity not just to do business, but also to catch up with a lot of old friends. So we're really looking forward to seeing you. Uh, please don't hesitate to get in touch with the team if you have any information or assistance that you may require. And thanks for tuning in today. And it just remains for me to say, we'll see you in camp. Looking forward to it.